and then the time if we go into the time in general the first uh work uh week so we started on sunday is the default but maybe you you started on monday so you can set that as the default if you want uh first day of of the work week and then the timesheet uh shows service fields uh when entering timesheet lets you specify service performed so the time when we enter the time uh that's going to be the, the time that we enter that we might use for payroll and we might also use that to process an invoice which is quite common in like a a, a job cost kind of system or like a an accounting firm or a law firm where you're going to be charging the time and this will when entering time lets you specify the service that's performed allow time to be to be billable so when we enter the time as a checkbox to specify whether the activities uh, should be billed to the customer so if we're entering the time because we then want to pull that information in a similar fashion as we saw with the expense form into an invoice then we want to be able to assign the customer so that we can then pull that information over we'll touch on that in the practice problem show billing rate to to users entering the form so we'll keep that off by the default.